Friday. Hey, everybody. everybody. Happy First Aid Friday. It's First Aid Friday again. Yeah. How was your birthday? That was great. Awesome. Uh, I haven't gotten to show this off in a video on my channel, but uh, thanks to uh, Azure for giving me this uh, nice fan. Oh, she's It'll so pull sweet. pull me off. Yes. Uh, her video just went live earlier tonight. Uh, yep. I'll link it in the description. Okay. Uh, but yeah, just uh, I guess that's spoilers for uh, part of the video. But uh, what she ends up unboxing is uh, going to be a surprise. Okay. But uh, yeah, um, that will come in handy. What do you think? Am I looking a little different tonight? Um. Well, it's looking a little bit familiar. From uh, well, before. yeah. I mean, I'm dressed a little bit uh, strangely yeah. because we're talking about one of my favorite things tonight: bear movies. Yeah. Yes. Yay bears! Yay bears! Salute to uh, Sh Cheddar Raccoon. Yeah! Yay bears! Yay bears! And what about um, Theodore Rabbit? Theodore Rabbit. Yeah. yeah. Well, uh, yeah, we need to shout out to rabbits too. Yeah, we, we ought to try to do a, a, a rabbit video at some point. But... I'm sure Max would love to do that with you. Yeah! Yes. Little uh, friend of. Uh, also, it's Jeff, the shirt uh, I got for, for my birthday. Right oh, hey! Nice. I noticed that shirt. Thank you for it, by You're the way. You're welcome, of course. I figured uh, first video after my birthday might be appropriate to wear one of the new shirts you got. And I'm made. actually wearing a shirt that was designed by a dear friend of mine, Jen. Oh! This was hand-painted by her. Really? Wow! This is um, one of my favorite movies we'll talk about tonight. Mm -hmm. This is Tennessee O'Neill. Okay. And I'm sure that nobody out there knows what movie we're going to talk about that I love. Hmm... Uh, if you have any guesses, uh, leave them in the comments below, That's and we'll right. see if you're yes. right. <laughs> so what should we start with? Uh, well, uh, I have movies. an honorable mention that I wanted to start off with. Okay. I, I know a lot of the videos usually put honorable mentions right before the last video, but right. I wanted to get this one out of the way. Uh, it's Over the Hedge. Oh, that shouldn't be an honorable mention. That's an awesome movie. It is an awesome movie. That's why I want to talk about it first. Uh, it's an honorable mention only because the fact that the bear is not the main protagonist or uh, heavily featured in the movie, but he is a uh, big part of the movie as he's the prime force that moves the story. Yes, RJ. I'm sorry, uh, Vincent. Yes. Yes. RJ uh, is the raccoon who's uh, seen on the cover here. Uh, he Just is like Shadow. Yeah. And he's played by Bruce Willis, and uh, he uh, ends up uh, hungry, and he can't seem to get any... Food out of the vending machine. Oh, wait, 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 where is it? Hold on. <laughs> oh, wait. So, yeah, he ends up sneaking into his uh, friend's uh, cave. Spuddies. And he has to get that last can of Spuddies. That's right. Because uh, enough is, is never, never enough. enough. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, he ends up uh, ruining all of Vincent's food, and uh, he threatens him with... Uh, Life and limb to get all of the provisions that he he uh, was dashing away for his uh, hibernation, right. including the red wagon. Yes, including the red little red wagon. Yes. Uh, or else uh, he's or gonna else, make him um, pay dinner. Yeah, he, he RJ yeah. would be dinner, I guess. Actually, <laughs> raccoon is really tasty. Really? I've had one. Yes. Um, don't don't tell Shadow. No, I won't do that. <laughs> I wouldn't eat Shadow. Shadow's oh, an good. awesome person. So, yeah, I uh, definitely recommend this movie. Uh, it, it's a, an awesome furry movie. The, uh, uh, unfortunately, the human characters uh, show up uh, a, f a few times, which is a little annoying. We don't want to talk about uh, the Deep Pelter 5000. Yeah, that, we don't need to talk about no. that. Uh, so, yeah, not, not all furry movies have to be exclusively with the animal or anthropomorphic animal characters. Humans can show up. Sure. But, uh, yeah. The main main action is all about these uh, awesome woodland critters. Yes. And uh, a bear is heavily featured, and I thought it made this one an honorable mention, but not worthy of being a member of the list, seeing as how, like, you can, the bear's yes. not even on the cover of course. here. Let's talk about bears on the cover. All right. Paddington. Yeah, Paddington. Paddington is an awesome movie. I, I had never seen that one until you showed it to me. Well, I'm glad I mean, you enjoyed it, I, yes. I believe I read a, a book. I believe it was a book first, right? Yes. I, I definitely know I read Corduroy. Yep. I want to say I might have read Paddington as a kid. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, it was interesting to get to see this movie. Uh, I have yet to see the sequel. I, uh, you, don't, you don't own the sequel, though, right? Um, I don't. I don't know. I think I might. I have to look on the shelf. 
Yeah, we, we got so many, it's hard to yes. keep track of them. But, but I know this movie is one of my... Well, it's an awesome bear movie. Yeah! One of my favorite scenes in this whole thing, and it's not going to give anything away, Okay. is when um, he's in the bathtub, and oh, the bathtub yep. actually runs down the spiral stairs. Oh. <laughs> yes. And he just basically says, I'm sorry, or something to that effect. Whoops. <laughs> Oops, yes. Whoopsie. So, anyway, Paddington, we'll put that aside. What do you got? I just remember when he was uh, using the toothbrush and cleaning all of his orifices. and then. Uh, oh, yes. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> like, that's not what a toothbrush is for! Ah! That's right. Yeah. <laughs> but he got his ears cleaned out well. <laughs> yeah. Yes. What's next? So what do you got? Next, uh, we've got the Care Bears and Care Bears 2. Oh. So, kind of a, a complete 180 going from CGI animation to uh, traditional 2D animation. Uh, but, but Braveheart Lion is in there. Yeah, there is. Go Yay Lions. Yes. Get, are we going to start a Yay Lions? <laughs> uh, sure. But no, yeah. we're not going to do a Yay Lions. It's like, Rrr, Lions. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Awesome. So yeah, uh, the original movie definitely is the standout uh, movie of the two. Yes. Uh, this is the one uh, where the magician shows up, right? Yes, absolutely. Yeah, so... Um, and kind of um, hypnotizes the boy into trying to take over the world, basically. Uh, well, at least the town, anyway. At least the town, right. With, I, I'm presumably, uh, asp uh, aspirations to go further. Yes. But, uh, yeah, he uh, ends up uh, really corrupted by this evil, uh, glowing magic book. Yes. And it's a shame it has to be a, an evil green magic book. Do why? not open a magic book if it entices you to do so. Why, why does everything evil have to be green colored? Well, in uh, Hocus either, Pocus, the book wasn't green. It's either green or purple, I swear. <laughs> um, I think green the book or purple was, seems to well, be the yeah, common... Colors of, of evil for some reason, well, and I so don't sweet. know why. Oh, thank you. Yes. But yeah, uh, definitely, you know, Care Bear's been around for a long time, and... Uh, and the Care Bear Cousins. Yeah, yes, of course. Care Bear Cousins uh, definitely were really cool to be introduced. I think they were introduced by the movie, weren't they? I believe so, yes. So, yeah. Definitely and of course, we've really got, um, what is it, Bright Heart Raccoon, I think it is? I believe so. That sounds yes. right. Which reminds me of Shadow. Yeah! And he's, it's a purple raccoon! I love yes. that raccoon. Now but we have... Good, good Luck Bear is my favorite, though. <laughs> the Brother Bear series! Yeah, Brother Bear! We have Brother Bear 1 and Brother Bear 2. Now, I've got to admit, as much as I like Coda... Uh, although it's... No, Coda. Yeah. Although, it, as he said, it's Coda. <laughs> I have to say that I love Rut and Toot better. Ah, okay, but they're not bears. They're not bears, you're right, but they make definitely a great comic duo. Yeah, they do, eh? Which is, um, <laughs> let's see, it's, um, oh my gosh, uh, it's from Saturday Night Live. It's Rick Moranis and Dave, oh my gosh, I'm uh... drawing a blank. I don't know. Uh, well, ha you guys can look it up. <laughs> Use your internets. Yeah. Yes. But um, they created the characters on Saturday Night Live, and they played Rutten Tooth the uh, Mooses. Okay. Yes. But, of course, Kenai and Coda. Coda are the two main bears. Yeah. And... Do we want to say how, how the movie starts? Uh, no. We don't want to give it away spoilers. Okay. So yeah, but the movie. Is I about, would say uh, out of my two, out of these two, I would say Brother Bear the original is probably my favorite. Yeah. Yes. But yeah, uh, without giving away any uh, any spoilers, the movie is about this uh, older bear and this younger bear as yes. they're on a journey uh, to go and uh, meet with a uh, other group of bears. Yes, they are. Well, yes, but along the way, they find out how um, how can I say this? How bears live. Okay. That's a good way to put yeah. it. Yes. So, and uh, and yeah, if you the, don't know the movie, you'll have to go watch it, because I don't yeah. want to give away the ending. And it's uh, very well animated, and it's got some nice songs, and yep. it's got a lot of fun uh, comedy. Absolutely. And, and, then, uh, and, of course, there's some tear jerkers. Oh, scenes. yeah, there's a bit of emotion um, in that i got to admit, although I am a tough, rough lion, mm -hmm. uh, there is one scene in there that made me cry. Aww. Yeah. So, anyways, yes. what do we got next? So, next we have Yogi Bear. Oh, love that movie. I'm smarter than the average bear. Yes. 
So, uh, this was definitely a very uh, big surprise. Uh, Dan Aykroyd is Yogi Bear, and Justin Timberlake is Boo Boo. Surprising. You would not believe how well they pull off these two characters. You'd swear they were the original voices from back in the day somehow. Uh, absolutely. They pull off their voices phenomenally. Yes. Uh, for being a, you know, a pair of really famous names attached to this movie... Usually that kind of just means they phone it in and it just sounds exactly like them. Right. In order to, you know, bring in parents who wouldn't be interested in seeing this movie and their kids are the only ones who are interested. Right. Uh, but yeah, they definitely did not pander uh, in that way. The fact uh, it really did feel like, you know, Yogi Bear and Boo Boo were back. And of course, there's a couple of cameos in there. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. And uh, yeah, it was... It, Definitely focuses on the two bears uh, for the majority of the story. They, yes. Uh, they don't, you know, start off as like the main characters and kind of fall into the background for a while or something like. Although they some do, movies do, they do do a little bit of stuff with Mr. Ranger. Yes, uh, Ranger Smith. Yes. Of course, because I mean, he's like the third main character of, of the course, of yes. Yogi Bear cartoon. Absolutely. But yeah, uh, Yogi Bear is smarter than the average bear, and this is a. Better than the average uh, movie. Movie, yes. <laughs> so, yeah, I definitely would say this is a, a good recommendation here, especially if you want to see any movie starring bears. Yay, bears. Yes, yay, bears. But, of course, we can't talk about bears without talking about... The Country Bears! The Country Bears! Yes! The all-time number one best <laughs> movie ever, The Country Bears. Yes! If you don't know, I happen to be a Country Bear fan. Mm -hmm. In fact, you can see I've got Tennessee O'Neill on my shirt. Yes, you do. You said and that earlier. I'm, I'm actually wearing, ah. you can probably tell, I own Trixie's jacket. Mm -hmm. This is the actual jacket that Trixie Sinclair wears in the movie. And I can actually prove that through some uh, photographic evidence that I have. Mm -hmm. um, I've got some screen captures. And I can prove that this is the only particular jacket that was ever created for Trixie Sinclair. Really? Yes. Wow. This is the number one thing. Although it's not my favorite character, I would love to, <laughs> I would love to own Tennessee O'Neill's vest. Mm hmm But I own this. So that makes me excited. All right. So this movie sucks. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> this is probably, well, I've already said my favorite movie ever. Um, it stars Diedrich Bader. You mean this movie? Oh, that's tough. <laughs> um, it may not be about bears, but uh, um, talk about your favorite movies. Uh, gotta, gotta. Pull all right, one. all right. Um, <laughs> Making him make the tough choices tonight. These are both the number one movie ever. <laughs> yes. Yeah, you go. All right. If I actually had to choose, <laughs> if you really want me to say. I would say the Goofy movie is probably my all-time favorite. A hundred, and this would be 99.9. <laughs> wow. How's that? Wow. Only because, okay. I, only because I love Max Goof. <laughs> he is my all-time favorite character. But we're not talking about Goofy tonight. No, he's not. a dog. <laughs> we're talking about he's, bears. He's, he's a goof. Yay, Bears. And that just happened to be right over there. Uh, of I, course I it did, yes. I like that, but of I was course. like, hey, I haven't seen a Goofy movie over there. I better grab that. So we've that. got Diedrich Bader. We have uh, Fred Garrett. Bra Brad Garrett. Brad Garrett. Excuse me. We have... Uh, he, he plays Fred Betterhead. Yes. We have Macaulay Culkin. Who, we have who? Macaulay Culkin. Macaulay Culkin from what? Home Alone? From Home Alone? Yeah, Macaul oh, yes. Yeah. Macaulay Culkin is uh, yes, the Macaul kid from Home Alone. He Home Alone plays too. Barry. Really? Yes. Uh, are you sure you don't mean Haley Joel Osment? No. no yeah, of course I do. You're right. Yeah. I don't know I, what I'm thinking. I mean, I'm uh, pretty sure uh, Macaulay Culkin would have been a lot older by then. Oh, he's the... Uh... Yeah. Ah! All right. Ah! Yeah. So you're right. It's Haley, o Haley Joel Osment. Yes. Uh, the Sixth Sense. How I see I dead do people. That? <laughs> My gosh. Oh, Me. you can tell we, di we didn't rehearse this, so... No, absolutely. We also have, um... Who's the... Um, uh, Reba McIntyre. Okay, yeah. And I can't think of the gentleman from the Eagles. Um... He sure. plays Tennessee O'Neill. Uh, and don't forget Christopher Walken's in this. Christopher Walken's in there, yeah. Now, do we want to say uh, what kind of part he plays? Is that spoilers? Uh, he plays the bad guy. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> 
Uh, it says, uh, let's see, the only other names they have on here are Daryl Chill Mitchell. Yes, he plays the other uh, cop. And Alex Rocco. Oh, and uh, Stephen Tobolowski. Uh, T- Stephen Tobolowski, yeah. Yes, the, from uh, uh, Groundhog Day. Yes. Yes. And He's Stephen Root team. is in this uh, as well. Oh, my gosh, yes, yeah, well, Stephen right? Root plays, um, he plays Zeb Zuber. Oh, yep, there you go. Yep. So, not that I uh, know this movie. <laughs> How could I make that mistake? <laughs> it's okay. Ah! I can't believe I did that. That's right. <laughs> well, it made for good entertainment, I hope. I hope so. It's already <laughs> 10 o'clock at night. What can I say? Well, just about. Yes, it's it's a Friday night. It's uh, First Root Friday. Yes, it is. It's First Root Friday. I have worked an entire day. I'm sorry if I made a mistake. <laughs> so, yes. But yes, so, go out. If you haven't seen the Country Bears, watch the Country Bears. And then uh, go out onto YouTube and find the Concert for America. Ooh. Yes, you want to see that. That is an awesome thing, and it was uh, broadcast on MTV. Really? Yes. Wow. I believe it was, um, oh my gosh, I can't think of the, 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 the star's name that used to do the... Um, I'm sure if I'm sure Junior were yes, here, he'd I'm sure know. Junior would know, but yes. So find that, and then, go. So, of course, go back and watch the original Country Beer show. So Junior, if you're watching, leave it in the comments. Yes, please do. And then go back and watch the Country Bear show from Disney World or oh, Disneyland. Yep, there you go. And that way you can see where this all originated it, from. It originated the Country Bear Jamboree, right? That's correct. Yeah. Kind of like Pirates of the Caribbean came from Pirates of the Caribbean. <laughs> which makes yes, no it, sense at all. They, they started off as uh, actual uh, pirates in the area of the Caribbean down uh, near the equator, right? Yes. Uh, and then they became a ride and then it became a movie. Yes. <laughs> oh, and Crystal's in this. The singer Crystal. Oh, yeah? She's in that, Oh, too. and uh, let's not forget uh, Jess Arnell. Oh, yep, you're right. Bears Rock! Um, Also known as... Wacko Warner! And Absolutely. so many other voices. Yes. But that's the one that most people might know him for. Did you know that Sakonko could do Yakko? <laughs> do a Yakko. Uh, <laughs> Go ahead. I have to have... I have to party! Party emergency! That's horrible. <laughs> I mean, in a good way. But a potty, a potty emergency is definitely a big thing. Yes. And uh, I'm sure Timber Puppers would do a lot better oh, impression. Oh, yeah, but you he, do good, too. He, he's, a, he's a really big fan of Wacko, I'm sure. He, he, I'm not wearing he any pants. He kind of takes big spree. I'm not wearing any pants. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I can't do it. I miss Timber. Where, where are you been, Timber? We Shout want to out see to more Timber, videos. yes. Yeah. I want Timber to make some more videos. I don't care if they're shorts. They're funny. Yes. They're entertaining. I love watching them. I liked his checkers video. <laughs> so anyway. Yes. We've gone through the few beer movies that we have. Yeah, I, I'm not sure if we have any other Watch ones this. that I could... Uh... This is this is a good movie. Yes. Watch this movie. I'm not sure if we have any other bear movies that I could, uh, could, could have pulled out, but I, I went through a bunch of the movies we had. I tried to add as many as I could. But this is uh, good for a Friday night. Yes. Yeah, I mean, I thought that the number of movies we covered here was pretty Absolutely. good. Absolutely. Uh, we still have a whole lot of movies to talk about in a future video. Uh, we'll hopefully be able to do that. We're rethinking how we're going to present the 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 list uh, video. Yes. Originally going to try to do the tier list uh, thing, but I don't know. We're, we're a little bit uh, less tech savvy than others, so... We're going to try to do something a little more... Um, a whiteboard and post-it notes. Yeah, I keep telling that, you. that's, that's yes. what we're going to do, this, I guess. Yep. But until then, uh, this has been Sakaka the Panda. And Lionel Lunt, Muscle Lion. Until next time, happy, happy Friday. 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 Bye-bye. And hopefully next time I won't be dressed so feminine. <laughs> Good night. Bye-bye.